Hello everyone, welcome once again to my YouTube channel DIY Repairs. Today we are going to fix the low battery issue in this Microtech Inverter 875E2. इस वीडियो को हिंदी में देखने के लिए डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स में दिए गए लिंक पर क्लिक करें। The voltage of battery is showing 11.85 volts in multimeter, which means the battery is good. You can see that inverter is connected to mains power supply and mains supply is also getting out but mains indicator in inverter is not glowing. It means that the mains fuse is good, that's why the output is coming. The problem is in the current sensing section of the inverter. Full detail with diagram about current sensing section is explained in my previous video, whose link is given in the description box. So let's open the inverter and check it. First of all, check the low voltage cut at pin number 2 of the microcontroller IC. You can see here only 1.41 volt is coming. It means low voltage cutoff is set around 210 to 230 volt AC approximately. Due to which inverter is not sensing mains line and battery drained out due to inverter running in UPS mode. And also due to not sensing the mains line, the battery was also not getting charged. Let us set the voltage of pin number 2 of the microcontroller IC by rotating this preset. You can keep its voltage between 1.5 to 1.7 volt according to the main supply in your homes. You can see that as the voltage of pin number 2 of the microcontroller set above 1.5 volt, both mains and charging signal started glowing. Let's see one more time. You can see that when the voltage at pin number 2 of the microcontroller IC is lowered below 1.5 volt, the mains and charging indicator turns off. And when the voltage is raised again above 1.5 volt, both the mains and charging indicator turn on. You can also check with the multimeter whether the battery is charging or not. Disconnect the positive wire from the battery and set the multimeter to 10 ampere. Connect the negative probe of the multimeter to the positive of the battery and connect the positive probe to the positive wire of the inverter. You can see that the battery is charging with 10 ampere current. You can also check the charging on pin number 4 of IC555 which is connected to pin number 26 of microcontroller. Here you can see that we are getting 1.25 volt. This voltage will decrease as the battery gets charged. If even after setting the voltage on pin number 2 of the microcontroller, the voltage is changing repeatedly or the voltage is not being set, then change this preset. Now you can see that the inverter is working perfectly in both UPS mode and mains mode. 